All right, today on this 2007 Chevrolet Tahoe, we're gonna install part number P303158 from Pupco. This is their Pupco liquid billet grill. In this particular unit we're going to install is our spiderweb version. All right, what this product does, it actually mounts on your top of your existing grill you have, so you don't have to remove any parts at all. It's pretty easy to install. We just have to loosen the grill up a little bit to get some working room, but that's about it. First thing we need to do is go ahead and open up the hood. The grill that's going to fit on top of this grill, the mounting point is about right in this area here. So to get to that, we have to reach in from the top and over, but it's really kind of hard to do with the space we have. So that's why we're going to loosen up the grill. And to do that, we've got a series of bolts on top to undo. Really easy stuff. Basically, we just need a little, about one inch of room and we're good to go. Okay, do a quick test fit. All right, we'll install bolt. Then we'll slip behind the grill and install the slow plate. And the nuts on the, the plate back here are nylon lock nuts, so they have a little bit of drag when you install the bolt. And we'll just get it drawn up just enough to hold everything in place. We'll go to the other side and repeat the same process. Okay. Alright, then there's just on the lower grill here, there's just one on each side, and there's two on the top. That makes our four. So once we have it set the way we want it, maybe a little bit left and right. Center it. And once you have it the way you want it, go ahead and snug these bolts down. Don't have to crush them, just enough to draw the two grills together. Looking good already. Let's go ahead and do the top half now. Let's go ahead and put the whole grill assembly back into position and put those bolts back in. We got our bolts snugged down, finger tight, and let's just go ahead and give them a quick turn with the wrench and we'll be good to go. All right, within 10 minutes time, we've already changed the look of this truck. All right, and with that, that finishes our install of part number P303158 from Putco.